each set technology. Today, we'll be dealing with the method used to measure FM or PM deviation and rate on a single analyzer. For the demo, we'll be using N5182 MXG vector signal generator and N9020A MXA signal analyzer. To measure FM deviation at the rate, we will utilize the MXG. Ensure the output of the MXG is hooked up to the input of the MXA. Set the frequency of the MXG to 1 GHz and go over the FM plus PM menu. From here, we can change the FM deviation to 100 kHz and change the FM rate to 10 kHz. Turn on the FM. We want to change the amplitude to minus 10 dBm. Ensure the modulation is on and the RF output is on. On the MXA, we want to change the mode to analog demodulation. Set the center frequency to 1 GHz and change the span to 500 kHz. Go into the measurement setup and measure FM. From here, we can auto bandwidth and scale in the measurement setup window. Now these four windows show distinct measurements. In the demodulation window, we can expand it and see the FM deviation going from 100 kHz to minus 100 kHz. In the next window, the AF spectrum, we can set a marker to the peak, and the marker clearly shows the FM deviation and FM rate. The FM rate is shown as 10 kHz, and the FM deviation is shown as 99.92 kHz. In the following window, this is shown numerically. The FM deviation on top and the modulation rate on the bottom. To measure PM instead of FM, we want to go into the measurement setup and measure PM. Repeat the same steps I just listed, and you will be able to measure PM deviation and PM rate. To recap, we showed how to measure FM deviation and FM rate on a signal analyzer. For more information, please reference the links in the description below or feel free to visit keysight.com. Thanks and have a nice day.